Question 2 of the GED Math Practice Test, that's the part 1, the part with the calculator. It says, James went to the nearby department store because he saw an advertisement that said all men's clothing was on sale. While he was there, a special sale started that said all clothes were at additional 10% off, off of the original price. If the advertisement promised that the men's wear would be 12% off at the checkout, how much will James have to pay at the checkout for a $53 suit? Okay, so we have to take this question bit by bit. All right, so here it says, okay, he went because he saw an advertisement on TV that says, um clothing was on sale all right okay you just saw a, a random advertisement on a department a nearby department store so while he was there a special sale started that said all clothes were an additional 10 percent of the original price okay and the advertisement promised that men's wear would be what 12 percent off at the checkout okay so we had a first what he saw first was 12 percent off all right, so we have to take out the 12% of this particular price of the suit. All right, okay, it says how much will James have to pay at the checkout for a $53 suit? So the original price of the suit, the suit is worth $53. And the first percent, the sale price he got, the first advert, uh, advert is so promised for 12%. So let's get 12% of what? $53. All right. Okay, and that was 12% of $53. That's 12 divided by 100 times what? 53. And this will give us what? This will give us um, $6.36. What cent, okay? So let's subtract this from 53. If we subtract this from 53, 53 minus 6.36. Um, punching your calculator, it should give you that's $46 and what? 64 cents. So this is the price to pay at checkout, okay, if there was no other um, sales offered, okay. But from our question, it says, why he was there, okay, why he was there, a special sale started that said all clothes were an additional 10% of the original price, okay. So it's definitely what from this word price, okay, from the word checkout um, after removing our first word percent, okay. So this is our this is now our what original word price, okay, because he watched the advertisement which gave 12% off. So his original price for this $53 suit is what for 6.64 cents. So when he was now buying again, another 10% off was given off now this price. Okay, so we now have 10% off 46.6 okay dollars. Okay, so and this will give us what 10 over 100 times what 46 points what 6 sorry six four okay if you punch in your calculator what are you going to get we are going to get what uh we're going to get four point what six six what four okay all right so let's stop at this so we're going to get four point six six for four dollars four dollars sixty six uh, cent okay okay i think um let's leave out this four so we just have four dollars sixty six what cent all right so from here we can now subtract this four dollars sixty six cent from forty six dollars sixty four cent to get the final amount he's going to pay for the suit okay so we have forty six point what six four then minus what four dollars sixty six cent okay so what do we have here we're going to have what let's borrow a one can we subtract six from four no we have to borrow a one and drop a one here six minus that's 14 14 minus six will give us what a eight okay and what are we left with here we're left with what five we, we can't subtract six from five we have to borrow a one that will give us what a 15 15 minus six what would that give us that will give us what a nine all right and what are we left with here we're left with what five five minus four will give us what a one don't forget the decimal point and four minus zero will give us what a four so this is the amount he is going to pay at checkout okay Okay, for the $53 suit after removing all the old uh, percent um, discount he has been given okay so our right option here is option 2